Daddy fakes right. He fakes left. He spins. Spin, 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 spin. Shoot. Score. Yes. 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 Yes, 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 yes. Love you. Love you. Let me ask you about Emerson. I remember a couple of years ago, mm -hmm. you and I exchanging pictures. Uh, I have an adopted daughter, yeah. you have an adopted daughter. I was adopted myself mm -hmm. too. This is like, just for context, it's pretty yeah, special yeah. special for me um, as well. Um, why did you, you and your wife decide to make an adoption plan? It was something that was always on my wife's heart. Um, ever since she was, I think she says, since she was like 10 years old, she always kind of knew adoption was something that she wanted to do one day. And we talked about it before we got married. I'm like, yeah, we can, we can do that one day. Thinking as an 18 year old kid, oh yeah, sure, well, whatever. <laughs> I, as long as I can keep you as my girlfriend at the time, like whatever makes you happy. But then uh, once we got married and we were starting to think about kids, um, we went to a, a fundraiser event for a charity out here in North Carolina and there was a, a story about a, an adopted boy there and on the way home she's like, I want to adopt a six-year-old boy right now. I'm like, hold on, pump your brakes a little bit. Like, what, what I, thought we were do, like I thought we were doing biological first, she wanted adoption. Yeah. So for about the next year, God really worked on my heart um, and really brought me to a spot where I was, I was happy to, uh, to go the adoption route first. I think our mindset was we just wanted to give a kid a loving home. It didn't matter who it was, we just wanted to go through that process and, and see how God worked through our lives, through our hearts, and he gave us Emerson, and it, it's been an unbelievable journey with her, learning a lot, I mean, she's amazing. Are you ready to talk about your colors? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Can you tell me what color? Yeah. Is? No. What is it? Yellow. Yellow. As an adopted kid, my adopted mom told me uh, while she was still alive, she passed when I was 16, she said, even if you don't want to have a relationship with your biological mm -hmm. mother, try to find her let her know you're okay, because mm -hmm. she's living with the idea of the unknown. Whether you have a relationship or not, yeah. give her that peace of mind, and, and it's worked out great for me. When you think of Emerson mm -hmm. in the future, what do you want for her? Something similar, something different? We wanted to be upfront with her from the very beginning, so she knows she's adopted already. We have an open relationship with her birth mom, and we see her every once in a while. It's something special, and hopefully a relationship that we can continue, and when Emerson's old enough to, to fully comprehend everything, she'll understand that she has two moms that love her to death. Um, and you have a biological child as yep, well, a yep, son? Yep. Charlie, uh, he's just over 10 months old now, and uh, my wife had him uh, last July. So him and Emerson are best friends, and they, they love each other, and he's, he's a fireball. Did you see anything different in your daughter's personality come out when Charlie came along? She was nurturing him right, right as soon as he got home. Like, she, <laughs> she was talking about making sure we're careful with him. And I mean, there was a, when my wife, we kind of first told Emerson that there was a baby in mommy's tummy, she was like, oh, can I watch the baby? And we're like, yeah, you can help us watch the baby. And she's like, no, like you go to the grocery store or something and I stay home and I watch the baby. <laughs> and so she's always just had like this nurturing, wow. nurturing side to her that's, that's awesome and always wants to help take care of him. So it's, it's special. Right back to Jacob Slavin. His chance to score! Slavin from the blue line. Does she like hockey? Oh, she does. She, she enjoys coming to the rink with me and skating and everything. And she'll go outside and play in the mud in a princess dress. So she's all over the place and enjoys just doing just about anything. Fake left, break right, goal! Go! 